Hello guys and gals, anyway I'm Clark here, I want to make a video, I made something in Minecraft I think you guys and gals should see, and it's a keynote Toten thing in Minecraft, but first of all, before I begin, I'm going to play a song, 115, and not only that, but I also want you to keep in mind, this is not perfect, this is not the best keynote Toten ever, and not only that, but it's missing a room and a, connect a connection room, so, yeah, just keep that in mind, and it's a little bit more open. Some rooms are better than others, and some rooms are, yeah, like, the main lobby, it's perfect. Almost perfect, actually. It's, it's fine, okay? And I try my best to get the guns with the right prices and the perks and whatever, so, yeah. And this is going to be a video, it's like a tour of the so-called Keynote Toten. And so yeah, just keep that in mind. It's not gonna be the best though. If you if you comment saying something like, "Oh, this is not a good Kinder to Toten," well, it got good until a lot until you got to the next rooms. I know, okay. I'm not the best at doing stuff in Minecraft, okay. I can't even do a goddamn house, and I think this is pretty good. What I did with Kinder to Toten. So yeah, and, I, and keep in mind, I did not make this from scratch. I pretty much had a structure already made, like, you know, I didn't start in an open field, I didn't start anywhere, I had, well, yeah, basically, I was in the tutorial, and I saw a big hill, and I had potential for, like, uh, an area, I wanted to make a house, like a diamond version of a mansion, and, it, like, needless to say, I ended up making a Keynote to Toten instead. <laughs> so, without further ado, here's Keynote to Toten in Minecraft and the song 115 by Elena Sigman. Let's go, and let's begin. And yes, I know I got messages, so don't worry about that. I know. Now...
Yeah, I couldn't show you all when the, until the song ended. I'm gonna show you all of it, and not only that. Wait. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to show you all of it, so don't worry. Okay, so this is the main lobby where you spawn. It's pretty much for the same part a good thing. It's really cool. The Olympia and the M14's up there, and here's Quick Revive over here. It's invisible. <laughs> Not just kidding. But, um, yeah, Quick Revive and Speed Call, Juggernaut, and all that is not available in Minecraft because there is no mod for it. There might be one on PC, but there sure as hell is not one on uh, PS3. At least not yet. And you can see the barricade over here. And let's start down here and go our way back up there later. Um, our barricade. Door that needs power, this will lead to the, um, power room. Um, uh, the actual theater. This is a theater. And here is the front thingy. I forgot some of the room's names, so please excuse me. MPL. Uh, barricade, another barricade. It's basically Kino to Toten, almost. There's a box spawn, door that costs a thousand. And if you want to see out here, yeah, this is basically where I know a zombie will be. He's like, yeah, 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 try to break down the thingies. This is a, I had the idea because I knew I had a lot to work with. You know, with all the barricades and stuff like that. So, yeah. Double tap. Another box spawn. AK-74U. Door, door that costs 1200 And barricade right there. And another barricade. Now, this is the room I was talking about. You see, there's nothing here. Well, that's because I couldn't find a way to link it to the theater. In the actual game, there was a way you could go down. You know, go down the stairs and down more stairs this way, which will lead you to the theater. Well, no, not here. Uh, another barricade and a box spawn. Good view from up here. That's perfect. Another area for enemies and wait a moment. Wait, wait just a Good lord, no -uh. I'm not gonna have any zombies like this. Alright, hold on. Just give me an idea here. Alright. And, yeah, I know what I'm doing, don't worry. Yeah, I'm kind of fixing it a little bit. Just a little bit. Yeah, now I know it's really going to be fucked up. But, yeah, there's a barricade right there, and I almost, I almost fixed it, because <laughs> I made it worse. And, yeah, I'm actually thinking about doing another version of this. A reaction video actually where I have some of my friends on the server on the server called Kino to Toten duh <laughs> but um and yeah basically I'll have this caught on camera put on YouTube so people like you guys can see my friends reaction to this Kino their Toten not exactly a replica, it's not a perfect resemblance, but it's close enough. It's close enough that I like it. And there's a barricade, there's the bathroom apparently. Um, then M a PM63, if only it was one more number higher, it would be PM64, Paper Mario 64. I imagine they change it to 63, if they probably, I said probably, I'm not real sure. But they might have had an idea for a 64, PM64, but they didn't want to confuse it with Paper Mario, 
and didn't want to have like a lawsuit and copyright issue and yada yada yada, but I don't want to talk about that. I don't really know why it's called MP63 and not anything else. And here, this is supposed to be the mysterious person, uh, I think Dempsey, Nikolai, Takio, and Rick Tolfin. And this is an uh, entryway for zombies and uh, mule kick. Door that costs a thousand. If we go down here, we see a stakeout gun, all invisible on our barricade. And we go down, MP40, and another barricade here, and speed cola. 30,000 points. Now, the the um, items, like, not the guns, but the perks, perk colas, speed cola, quick revive. I didn't need to use the Wikipedia, the, the Call of Duty Wiki, Wiki, or Call of Duty Zombies Wiki, or whatever, to know their prices, because I've used them so much, and I, I always use the perks, and I know how much they cost. That and I watch a lot of zombie videos, so even if I didn't know the prices by using the perks a lot, I would know by watching Mr. Dollar JD and stuff like that. So and the syndicate plays and whatever. Whatever that does zombie, like relaxing end and whoever else. Door that costs fifteen hundred. Okay, I think. Eh. Might as well put a box. Wait, do I have a chest? Ah, perfect. So yeah, this is as good as you're going to get. So yeah. And if you go here, MP5K, some barricades, and yeah. Do I cost 2,000? This will lead you to the room, the part of the theater. Claymore costs 1,000, another barricade, and M16 costs 1,200. Power switch, multiple switches, if you use these, this will be the power. <laughs> and here you have uh, some barricades and stuff. And go here, here's everyone's favorite Prokoa, Juggernog, oh, and the Bowie Knife, can't forget that beast. And let's, let's see, let's go back up, and it, assuming you turn on the power, you get access to these rooms, and you'll be able to go from the start, all the way back to the beginning. Now with these, you have to use your imagination. Not necessarily um, ideal, if you want to do it in real life. Like, play Minecraft, and if there's no gun mods on the PS3 edition, there's no... Uh, Nazi zombie mod on Minecraft or anything like that on the PS3. There's nothing that will have you the satisfaction of killing zombies either. If there was, this is Keynote Toten, so you could use those two mods and you could then, you know, play. Have some friends over if you want to play with your friends or if you want to play solo, you could do that too. It's fun. And let's see. I want to show you something over here. You see the sign right here? Welcome to Keynote or Toten. Well, let's open up this chest, then you'll see Welcome to Kino, right? Well, this says Welcome to Keynote or Toten, the Theater of the Dead, right? Well, look at this one. Welcome to Keynote or Toten, the Theater of the Damned as well as the Theater of the Dead. So, some of the books I actually wrote here, it says Welcome to Kino to Toten. I actually wrote these individually. Now I know how some book authors feel using doing all their books by hand. Ah. Alright. Hey, what does this one say? Fear of the Dead.
Okay, what is this one? The Theater of the Damned. Place one, place one. Okay. Then we got some Dorite, or Dorito as I call it. Block of Diamond, and I got all the wool over here, iron ore, and stuff like that, so yeah. This has actually been my version of Keynote or Toten, and, um, if you liked it, leave a like, and comment what you thought. Do you think it was a good attempt at making Keynote or Toten in Minecraft? Do you think it was a poor attempt? Do you think it was somewhere in the middle? Let me know what you guys and gals think. And I'll make another video of a, a reaction video of sorts with my friends and I on PlayStation. You know what my reaction is. I think I did pretty damn well over here. But, um, I want to see it, what my friends think. So, but first of all, I'm going to ask if they want to be on video or whatever. And if not, then they're not a part of the YouTube community. But if they are, then they will... Yeah. They'll be a part of it. Like, uh, Caution. My friend Caution. You remember him from my Doom gameplay? Well, it's Sonic Doom 999, but same guy. He would probably like it, but I don't know. So let's exit the game and save it. I will see you guys and gals later. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you later. I said, see you later. Good lord! Eh! <laughs>